In Summit County, the fall is getting left behind and winter's rolling in. Sounds like they're calling for three to six inches today. It's snowing and we're so excited. Just in time for ski areas like Loveland, A Basin and Keystone to ramp up their snowmaking. We started snowmaking operations Saturday. Feels really good to have the snow guns on. We started making snow on Saturday. As a winter storm drops several inches of snow on these ski areas, icing up the ground. It's what the snowmakers love, low humidity and mother nature dropping a little white stuff on the mountain. So all three of them can make even more snow in the coming days. We have good temperatures coming this week and I think we're going to be in a good partnership with mother nature over the next few days. As they race. I'm really excited to have the race back on. We're planning to open as early as possible we can here at Keystone. To see which ski area will be the first to open in Colorado. It's a win-win when it snows. Um, if we can all get open, it's good for Colorado. Win-win for the ski areas, not so much for drivers. There have been slick and icy conditions in the high country, especially along I-70 at the higher mountain passes, like at the tunnel, where we're starting to see some problems again this morning as the snow falls and the roads remain pretty slick. But this is a welcome sight for the ski areas, especially when you compare it to last season and how dry it was. Keystone not opening until November 6th, a basin November 9th. Wolf Creek beat everyone when a big winter storm dropped a lot of snow in the southern mountains, and they opened and then closed. But were the first to open and Natasha, we could see that again this season because of all the snow that the southern mountains got. Maybe Wolf Creek will pull another upstate. We'll have to see this pretty good storm for the central and northern mountains as well. Yeah, absolutely excited for that. Matt, thanks so much.